Okay, so we're still doing this problem. I nearly ran out of battery, and uh, or memory. So we're doing this problem right here, the number 10 on page 32. And I just flipped back to show you your rule for, um, well, let's see, when you're, you've got a sum divided by a sum, we know that if our powers up top are an odd number, that it will come out even. We don't have to worry about a remainder. So that's good to know. So this one will come out even, sum divided by a sum. And our other rule is, if it's a plus, if it's a sum on the bottom, your signs will come out alternately. The first one will be a plus, the next one will be a minus, plus, minus. And we already know, so this is your, that was your law of signs on page 31. Your law of exponents is the one that I was explaining, the one that tapers. When you have an a cubed, you step down to a squared b, and then a and b starts going up, b squared, and then b squared, I mean b cubed, just by itself. So that's that rule. All right, so what we're going to do is we're just going to say, okay, I know my answer. My first one is going to be a step below whatever this one is. 3r cubed, all right, my first one will be 3r squared, okay, step below. Now I'm going to step down with the a value one time. This was a positive sign, remember? When we have a sum on the bottom, we have to alternate. So the next one's a negative. 3r squared minus, okay, now my a steps down again to just 3r. And then it, and then it, my b comes into play. So where's my b? It's a 2. This is b, this is b cubed. See how we had to change the 8 so that it would be a, a b value, sort of just a, to the same power as my a. Anyway, so 3r and b steps in. Now we're doing a plus. See, we're alternating like the rule told us to. We're doing a plus. Okay, so 3r times 2. Now, that was a in its lowest form. a is out of the picture. Now b is just climbing. 2 squared minus, well, b has reached the same height that a had at the beginning. So really, I don't even do that. Okay, so that should be our answer if our rules and if are telling us right and if I'm doing the right kind of job. Um, you, you could finish that out. You could probably say, um, I'm going to quit worrying about the plus in the front, but you see why I did that plus, minus, plus. All right, so our answer would be 3r squared, or you could say 9r. Um, it'll be 3r squared, or just 9r squared. Um, anyway, I'm going to write it like that. Minus 3 times 2, 6r plus, and that's 2 squared, so it's plus 4. Let's see if that's what comes out when we do just a regular long division problem.